Good morning, Hutchison High School. I'm Emily Grimes, and this is your Hawk Hit News. This week, we here in broadcast journalism have been completing our finals, so each of us has to create the news on our own. Now let's get into the Hawk Hit headlines. A top medical college has recently caught students using spy cameras linked to smartwatches to cheat during exams in what social media users compared to a plot straight out of a Mission Impossible movie. Three students used glasses with wireless cameras embedded in their frames to transmit images to a group of yet unnamed people who then sent the answers to the smartwatches. The team did this in real time and would have gotten away with it if it weren't for those meddling professors. A couple of eastern Colorado teenagers posing for a traditional prom photo received a unique memento as the girl's mother snapped the shot with a tornado in the background. The mom of the girl said that the twister first appeared on the horizon. She and her 15-year-old daughter, along with the girl's boyfriend, had sought shelter indoors. Then, when the twister started to move away, they went outside and posed for photos in a neighbor's backyard with the tornado in the background. That's one twisted prom night. British officials were branded as spoil sports Friday after refusing to name a polar research ship Bodie McBoatface. The public was asked last month to submit suggestions about what to call the state-of-the-art vessel and vote for their favorite using an online poll. However, the internet being the internet, the runaway winner was not the name of a famous explorer or scientist as organizers had hoped, but RRS Bodie McBoatface, which received more than 124,000 votes but the voice of the people was not heard. Michael Grant, otherwise known as Philly Jesus, spent 12 hours behind bars after Philadelphia police say he refused to leave the Center City Apple Store. Investigators said employees asked him to remove a cross he had taken inside the store because it was blocking an aisle. Grant refused to remove the cross and he was then asked to leave the store. Investigators say Grant refused to leave after being asked three times. The store manager then contacted the police. That's it for the Hawk Hit Headlines. Now over to Emily Grimes with the news you need to know. Thanks, Emily. Let's get into the news you need to know. Do you need to make up a class you failed? If so, stop by counseling to pick up summer school paperwork. Do you want to take a class to get ahead? If so, we also have summer enrichment paperwork. Stop by counseling for more information. UAF is giving one scholarship for a three-credit class this summer. If you are planning on taking a UAF class this summer, write a brief essay on what your plans are and which class you plan on taking this summer. Turn your essays into Miss Luther no later than Friday the 13th. Mentors will be having a strategy planning time for next year. Meet in the health classroom on Friday the 13th morning to plan with your committee. All mentors must attend to get summer assignments. See Ms. Driscoll for any questions. That's it for the news you need to know. Now back to Emily in the studio. Thanks, Emily. Now we have a special segment made by Arts AV's very own Emily Grimes. Let's take a look at some of Hutchison's favorite parts of this school year. My favorite part of this school year was the very first assembly. My favorite part of the year was probably spring break. My favorite part of the hut school year is the Hutchison's Akadeka state trip and nationals trip. My favorite part of the school year was meeting all the new teachers that came to Hutchison High School. The beginning and the end! That's all we have for the Hawk Hit News. Tell us what your favorite part of the school year was by clicking the comments link below. Thanks for watching. Stay fly, Hawks. And I know she'll be the death of me. At least we'll both be numb. And she'll always get the best of me. The worst is yet to come. But at least we'll both be beautiful and stay forever young. This I know.